Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Commander Tasha Bryant. I'm the commander for the first district. I'm here to give you guys a quick update about what we know preliminarily about today's events. So about one o'clock this afternoon, we responded for a report of a shooting. Our units responded to the scene and located an adult male suffering from gunshot wounds inside of a vehicle. Despite all life-saving efforts, he was pronounced deceased on the scene here. Preliminarily, what we do know is our victim was the target of this attack. We do have preliminary footage of a dark colored SUV seen fleeing from the location at a high rate of speed a short time after the shooting occurred. We're following up on all video footage here. You see behind me are detectives that hit the ground running trying to get the most available information possible now. Once we have more, we'll circle back to you guys and push out updated information. At this time, this is all we have. Our victim was an adult male. We saw a woman be transported just now. Uh, she came out of the stadium, is that what it Not connected. This is not connected to that at all. I'm hearing that she may have placed a bet and then afterwards, just moments earlier before the shooting, do you want anything? Is that tied at all? Preliminarily, we're not sure if that is connected. As I stated, once we have more information available, we'll come back and let you guys know. In the, in the meantime, we're asking anyone that has any information relative to today's incident to contact us at 202-727-9099, or you can text us 50411, any, any information. But where did the victim come from? Where did he step out of? The victim was inside of his vehicle when we arrived on the scene. But prior to that, do you know anything? We, at this time, we are not sure. And I don't want to speculate because it's, all of this is preliminary. Uh, age, any? Adult male. Last question, please. Spell your name. I apologize. It's going to be Commander Tasha. That's T-A-S-H-A, B-R-Y-A-N-T, Metropolitan Police Department, 1st District. Just any message to the community. I know this is a busy time, especially in this neighborhood. We see pictures, people running from the patio of the restaurants here, just a message to them. Well, when this event happened today, fortunately, we did not have a lot of traffic out here. This, no one, thank God there were no other targets, victims, or property damage except for this one. Any loss of life is one too many for us. We're committed to removing the drivers of gun violence from our community, and we need our citizens and visitors to help us. Any information you guys have that can help us solve this case is greatly appreciated. We're committed to keeping this neighborhood safe and to making this a place where people feel comfortable coming, spending time. It's, a, it's game day. I want everyone to feel comfortable coming here and enjoying this beautiful city, the restaurants, and watching the games. That's all I have. Thank you. Thank you guys for your time.